हेलो हेलो बोंगेल माना इंची बोंगेल माना इंची ले ओ निले ओ नोंगे हापा कुमारा या कुआंजा कबीसा kama waziri wa ukatuzi wa bunge <laughs> and for that we should all clap so uh what's wrong with you you know our high school teacher used to tell us that if you have nothing to say don't say it here so kwa ile maneno ambayo inaongelewa leo Waja nianze na mambo na tax evasion. Tax evasion is a fruit of the underlying problems that we are suffering from as a country. Shida ya kwanza ambayo imeleta mambo ya tax evasion na mande laundering ni ufisadi. Isi bidi ya Nairobi kuna mtu wako na duka ya, ma, ya manguo pale. Ameajiri vijana saba. The whole day customer wenye wame walk into that shop ni wawili. Na mwenye amenunua ni mmoja. Amenunua suti ya shilingi 1800. And maybe in a month he has only managed to sell two suits. But analipa mshahara vijana nane each young man going home with 25000. We open businesses to make profit. But if we look at your pro- business in the cbd it is giving you more loss than profit then we ask ourselves why did you open that business it is a curtain for money laundering we must look into such things another thing that is causing a lot of money laundering tume tumekuwa na a culture of get rich quick schemes uh, mtu anataka atoke shule leo and in the next few years three years you have a bungalow in Siokimau you are rolling in a G wagon it doesn't happen like that you have to go through the process in a way that nikiwa na 200 hapa leo ukiniuliza umetoa hii 200 wapi nafaa nikuelezee nimetoa wapi money is not just plucked from the air Now, either umepewa ama umefanya kazi mahali ukalipwa mshahara but if you have money and when we ask where did you get the money you will start stories then we should take all the money that you have mimi nadhani we should uh, our members our public officials should be required by law to state satisfactorily how did they acquire the properties that they have we have a member of parliament here who managed to buy a prime plot at Upper Hill using a salary of 45000 shillings i don't know how genius he is in money uh, in money management in, in money yes uh, that guy is a miracle worker <laughs> because with a salary of 45000 the guy managed to buy a plot Upper Hill build flats there in that plot started a business Amatatu business in Kikuyu town with the same salary of 45000 shillings sijui alipewa loan na atalipa hard lien na ukimuuliza huyu mtu hii pesa alitoa wapi hawezi kuambia and they are the flag bearers of our nation so you kitoka hapo ukienda nchi nyingine ukisema tu wewe ni mkenya people start guarding their pockets because they know you are a, a skillful conman You are a skillful swindler. Today when you arrest any suspect of money laundering, anajuana na wetangula. Ukweli, nitajie mmoja ule aliwahi shikwa na ajuani na wetangula, sema hapa. When you arrest any suspect of money laundering, he has in one day met wetangula face to face. And if I'm lying, any other person with the contrary opinion to come and say it here because we are dealing with the root in our society we have been grey listed as a nation as a ground for wash wash the people who are murmuring behind here cannot speak before a camera 
Absolutely. When you give them a chance, they be they become stammerers. <laughs> but they are very good at murmuring behind here with points of order. They are not even orderly themselves. Even one has already identified himself. <laughs> 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 Yes, this guy comes from Bukoma. Uh, you know, you know, from... uh, let me let me finish by saying this. Okay. Uh, let me finish by saying this. Unajua kwetu kuko na msemo ukiinua mwiko hivi. Na umbu abweke na sio yeye ulikuwa anataka kupiga. Huyo umbu ndiye anaiba ana, ana nyama kwa hiyo nyumba. <laughs> Mimi sijaguza mtu jina yake, mbona analalamika? <laughs> si waje mwenye nimetaja alalamike. Eh? <laughs> yeah? Kama wewe sio mane Londara, why are you why are you making noise? <laughs> I am making I am I have mentioned a person. Those are not assistants, those are beneficiaries. I am mentioning a person. <laughs> mwenye even the public media has linked him to these schemes. I'm not coming up with things. Mr. Speaker, what is the other agenda I finish? Tax evasion, Mr. Speaker, it is not done by the holoi poloi of the society. Tax evasion is done by the high and mighty in the society. Because how can you come up with a scheme of evading tax if you cannot Ukishiku hapa saa hii inabidi tukuchangie. You cannot evade tax. Wale watu ambao wana evade tax. I don't know if we can call them unscrupulous business people. These are the people who meet the people from Times Towers in a hotel somewhere. Bagain agree. Wewe hii mwezi mimi nitalipa 1300. Na ametengeneza Billions of profits. As I finish, Mr. Speaker. Yeah, kindly. In the interest of time. As I finish now, I am speaking as a CS for devolution. Yes. For Bungalam Wana Inch. You know, you don't fight with a pig in a muddy area. <laughs> you will all get, get hey, and the pig will enjoy the mass. Yeah, <laughs> it's a pig. <laughs> you are a grab because you have been called a pig, my brother. <laughs> so <laughs> they have said you are a pig and you are a grab. Uh, as, <laughs> as the president said it. As the president of Bunge said it once here, we will be working on a scheme where Bunge la Mwanainji is incorporated in all public participation processes in this country. So that we as Bunge la Mwanainji, our brains does not just waste away sitting on this concrete. We can be a useful group in this country. Thank you very much, Mr. In a minute, in a minute, then in a minute. In a minute.